The whole focus for me has always been to help young people from backgrounds that I come from who maybe don't have the spotlight put on them and the opportunities put in front of them. I took that upon myself and the great team that I've got around me. I, again, I can't take the credit. I think the team, Rhiannon, Gary Stanett and all the people behind the scenes with those guys. There's some good people. I'm going to introduce you guys to some people today that have kind of come through the foundation but also come through different businesses that I've got now who are really making good strides. Stand up, introduce yourself, man, come. Hi, I'm Kalechi. Been working with Joel in Rio uh, for quite some time now, but I'm working at UEFA now, doing like the social for them. So after this, be going to London, be talking about the Champions League. And yeah, just want to say thank you to Rio and Joel just for everything they've done for me, because without them, I wouldn't have the job I have today. So mm. yeah, thank you. Well, you're already split into groups. They're going to come around. You can ask some questions, really get involved. This is your opportunity. You've got 40 minutes to really get under the thick and the skin of the film production, any aspect of film that you want to get into. These are your guys. So, shall I start the clock now? 100%. Let's go! Woo! Ferdinand Foundation for making this whole day. And this is what we're about, making sure that there's people who are given fair opportunities, making sure that we can encourage people. Like Rio said earlier on, not here to just give things, but to provide opportunities and point people towards the right direction. You got here, Rio. He's talking to all the young people at the moment. He's been stuck on this table for like a good 15, 20 minutes. I know that he's got some great, great, great advice to give these young people. So we can only be thankful. Look at him, he's actually having a good time as well, which is great. What are you doing here? Uh, I'm filming for Kiss FM. Yeah. Helping out the young people. Yeah, yeah. You've got a heart. I've got a heart and I love what the Rio Ferdinand Foundation stands for. Three words to describe the Creed Free film. I'm going to do this, but it's not three words. Never give up. <laughs> Maybe I should just say never give up. Mr. Ferdinand, mm, what's up, how's it going, man? I'm all right. Just taking a break. Yeah, taking a break. So you come to me? Yeah, exactly. Listen, man, because I ain't got nothing going on now. Nah. Yeah, you got a few bits. It's nice to see you uh, supporting anyway. I like it. I appreciate it. And why are we here today, Mr. Ferdinand? We're here with the Rio Ferdinand Foundation, with Warner Brothers and with KISS, who have kind of, kindly kind of got involved and helped us in terms of creating opportunities for young people. That's what we do at the Foundation. We've done it for over 10 years now. And with the help with these guys, among other sponsorships and involvements, it's like the Foundation's going from strength to strength. It's, it's amazing. And today we've got people that have actually come through the Foundation and doing positive stuff. They're in lines of work now, who are going to inspire this next generation to take that road and that path too. Guys, thank you very much for your time and I want you to keep inspiring the young people that are here. I think they want to see your faces. Thank you. Now nah, we're here, we're representing, man. Like. It's a good example, that's the thing. Yeah. You're a good example for the young people here. Like you, you haven't just like, been given an opportunity. I've seen you grafting for years, so and you're doing what you're doing now. Appreciate it, man. Cool. Thanks to you. We've got another special guest joining us today. Mm. Um, yeah, I thought, listen, inspiration and inspiring you guys, I think, is a, the key part of what we're trying to achieve today. And um, I thought, listen, let me try and work a little angle, use the contacts of Warner Brothers, etc., and um, bring you down somebody who can inspire you guys, um, who's done some magical stuff, genuine guy, successful, um, somebody who looks like yourself, and also a director, the star of Creed, Michael B. Jordan, come through. <laughs> <laughs> I told you! Make some noise! <laughs> What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Good? Good, thank you. Good? Good. Yeah, yeah, good stuff. Can I just say I something? So can, you, can you hear me? Can I just say something? How come I didn't... I know, I knew he was going to say that. I knew he was going to say that. <laughs> 
Right. A celebrity. So, you know, with all the people that's in here, everybody's here to help you. You know, everybody's here as friends, people that want to see you guys do well and be successful. So don't be shy, you know, you know, and, and, and go after what you want. I think that's really important. I'm not content. I like to evolve and grow. So uh, whenever I get too comfortable, I'm always, uh, I start to feel a little unsettled and, and look for the next thing to kind of, you know, how do, how do, I, how do I get uncomfortable, mm. you know? Um, I think being comfortable, being uncomfortable is, is, is something that I you should that, be used to, you know? I love, I love um, that, I live by that as well. Yeah. So on that part of your journey when you felt like things weren't going to plan, everything felt hard, like everything felt like, you know, I can't get this, I can't do this, I can't do that. And your mind was going crazy. How did you manage to keep yourself going? I mean, it was a time I was getting ready to give up. You know, I had moved from New Jersey to California to, uh, to, to really pursue acting. Moments where you feel like you want to quit and you want to give up is usually the moment when it's about to happen for you. Um, one last thing I think is like, you're in a room, like I said before, I'm repeating myself, but I think if, another thing about when I was young, that I'd say to myself is, don't be uh, uh, scared to ask questions. Like, there's no stupid question because you clear something up in your mind. Even if that person thinks, oh, that's, that's quite an easy thing, but for yourself, you've got an opportunity to ask a lot of questions today. Ask them, because there's people here that actually genuinely want to help you. So thank you guys for turning up as well. Thank you, Mike. create the opportunities beyond the education piece. I think it's, when I'm, I'm not about giving people nothing. I don't even give them nothing. I don't believe in giving people anything, but I believe in presenting an opportunity for people to put their best foot forward. This is what this is about.